Are you going to stay in the race, Leader McCarthy? You're not yes. I'm okay. not going anywhere. Are you sick? No, I just wasn't. Um, Here, can, I, can I trade places with you? Uh, we, we did have an intense conference, and it's intense for a purpose. We have worked for a long time. I've been leader for four years. I came into this position, and we had less than 200 members. We are now sitting in the majority. We put forth to the American public a commitment to America. There's times we're going to have to argue with our own members if they're looking at for only positions for themselves, not for the country. For the last two months, we worked together as a whole conference to develop rules that empower all members. But we're not empowering certain members over others. Last night, I was presented the only way to have 218 votes if I provided certain members with certain positions, certain gavels, to take over the church committee, to have certain budgets. And they even came to the position where one, Matt Gates, said, I don't care if we go to plurality and we elect Hakeem Jeffries and it hurts the new frontline members not to get reelected. Well, that's not about America, and I will always fight to put the American people first, not a few individuals that want something for themselves. So we may have a battle on the floor, but the battle is for the conference and the country, and that's fine with me. What do you think the, the country battle is for the conference and the country? Yeah. But the problem is, is that you have a math problem, you just can't get there. So what do you do on the 10th vote, the 30th vote, the 50th vote? If it just doesn't move. Look, I, I have the record for the longest speech ever on the floor. I don't have a problem getting a record for the most votes for speaker you too. Thank you all. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't see how a few people, maybe it's five, maybe it's twenty, sit because they want a gavel that they can't earn by the conference of themselves. That would be interesting to me. That's not what the constituents voted them for. What do you think is the first impression of a Republican majority for America? Unify the conference.